2023 continues with quick and effective ways to decompress in one minute or less. Here with some great tips is best-selling author and host of the podcast, Dear Gabby, Gabrielle Bernstein. What's up, guys? We're not, we're not rushing to decompress in, in less than a minute. This is a no, real no. sort of No, no. This like, is about oh. making it easy and accessible so that you're not stressed out about trying to de-stress. Right. <laughs> right. So how does somebody know that, all right, it's time for me to take a step back and, and decompress here? A everyone must take a step back and yes. decompress <laughs> these days. But I think you really know it when you're starting to feel like you can't sleep at night or your stomach is in knots or you're overly anxious. What if you live like that? <laughs> That's I should thing. come hang out with you yeah. for a little while. Yeah. Well, come, we can, we can. She said, she said, I think you guys probably all need this <laughs> around here. We um, definitely do. We're always it. on the go. But yeah. give us some quick tips. So like if we're running and rushing around, how can we constantly have a moment to, you know, chill for a second? Okay. So we're talking one minute or less. So let's talk about this one breath practice first, okay. which is called the one minute breath. But you can even do it for 15 seconds. And it's breathing in for five out, holding for five and breathing out for five. Okay. But this is the most important part. Please put your hand on your belly. Everybody oh, watching, no. hand oh, on your gut. belly. And you I want just that. gentle and let make sure on the inhale that your diaphragm is extending. And on the exhale, it's relaxed. So through the nose? So the, have, yeah, follow okay. me. You can I'll breathe through you. your I'll nose. Yep. We'll okay. In, two, three, four, five. Hold it. Two, three, four, five. And relax the diaphragm for two, three, four, five. Keep going. One, two, three. <laughs> so, we have more. But breathing really is, is it essential, right? everything. And, and always, even if you just take this, just checking that you're breathing with the inhale and the diaphragm extending. That's the biggest thing right there. There are not a lot of uh, like motivating meetings around here, so mm -hmm. sometimes we need to build our own self-confidence. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> How do you recommend if we have a minute or less alone? This seems we can like do a pretty that? confident crowd to me, but I'm gonna give you something, okay? okay. So up, get up. Oh yes. Oh, All right. We're posing. So Hold on. Hands on your hips. I want to see your best Superman, Superwoman pose. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe you know, lift your I'll legs out a little feet. bit. Shoulders back. You might even want to close your eyes and just feel into this power pose. Mm. And do you feel it right now? Drop your shoulders, Ryan. Oh, now I do, shoulders. yes. Yes, okay. <laughs> okay. And just standing in this power pose is such a powerful thing to do it right before a meeting, right before <laughs> a Welcome date. home, honey. Yes, exactly. <laughs> well, well, Kelvin, Kelvin, let's go walk the dog. <laughs> <laughs> I, I love it. I need to Georgia. Stand, my four-year-old needs me to be in my power pose. Yes. <laughs> yes. All right, so what about anxiety relief? What about okay. that? Because a lot of folks are hit with that stress all the time. This one, this is a Kelly Ripa favorite. She taught this to you, actually. She um, did? Yes, I taught it to her, and she loved it so okay. much. So this is... um. It, in between your, this is a Oh, she point. did tell me this. The yes. EFT, emotional freedom tapping point, emotional freedom technique. You tap um, on this little spot right here between your ring finger and your pinky finger. Mm -hmm. It's called the gamut point. This is the okay, right, Yeah, it. it's right there, it's right there. <laughs> and as you tap on this point, you would affirm, I am safe. So I, I say that? Say, say it in, inside or outside. Say, say it internally or you can mm -hmm. say Just it out that. loud. Mm -hmm. no I am thing. safe. I am safe. I am safe. Ryan, look I'm at watching me. watching Megan. I am safe. <laughs> exactly. Am safe. When you're watching that, you guys definitely feel safe. So, so that, that point sends a message to your brain that it is safe to relax and it lets the nervous system settle. So do that on the subway. Do that, you know. Really? It looks like a nervous told, move, You got to go on the air. But it's yeah. not. You know, it looks like you're nervous about something, but it's. So that's why you might want to just do it under the table. <laughs> no, just keep it to yourself. All right. <laughs> okay. We are going to take a break. Come back. More ways. Do it with us after this to decompress. Be right back. <laughs> so during the break, we were talking tapping. Yep. Yeah. And now there's something that you do with relaxing the tongue. Yeah, this is a Break that one. down for this us. One, everyone, no one can say they have an excuse for this. We all can do this. Just relax your tongue. Try it right now. How do you relax your tongue? Okay. Right. It's usually at the top. <laughs> okay. Relax your tongue to the bottom of your mouth oh. and just let your jaw relax. Breathe deeply. And, and what, is, what does it do when you relax your it, tongue? Well, it's just letting your whole system settle, letting your mm. face relax. You'll notice even when you relax your tongue that your jaw will relax, your shoulders will relax. Everything sort of drops. And it's a cue. It's, mm -hmm. a, it's, a, it's a relaxation cue. It's a, okay, well, I'm stressed out. Relax your tongue. So some of us here have bedtime ceremonies before we go to bed. Could be dimming the lights, reading a book, lighting, lighting the candles. The incense, I, that's the way to sage. I have a lot of it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so what do you suggest or recommend we do to calm ourselves down so we can fall asleep? You can call this one the Gelman, because Gelman <laughs> loves this one. <laughs> or I, I'm going to expect that he tries it tonight. So, so your hand on your heart and your other hand on your belly. And when you put the <laughs> hands on your heart and belly like this, you're in a heart hold. 
And again, this is a hold that allows you to feel a sense of safety. Mm -hmm. And often when we're trying to fall asleep at night or we're waking up in the middle of the night, there's anxiety again. Yeah. And so that anxiety is a sense of feeling unsafe. So just placing your hand on your heart and just breathing deeply and exhaling completely. And, and what's your ceremony before you go to oh, sleep? Oh, I have, oh my God. But just I, run I put my quickly. phone to bed in the other room. Okay. In the other I room? Have, oh yeah, I have like red <laughs> lights and I've got like <laughs> machines I put on my legs for compression. I mean, it's like. What time do you start the process? I, 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 put, <laughs> I put my child to bed at eight o'clock and then I'm <laughs> and then in bed start... <laughs> and I get going. My husband wow. hates it. He walks in, there's literally, I'm not even kidding, a red light and like boots on, these compression boots. I mean, it's unique. It's different. It's Listen, we all have to get good yeah, no, sleep, it's, it's, people. It's, it's true. Yeah. It's as important as anything. Yes. All right, any other final tips before we have to go? Yeah, this is a really important one. I want all the moms and dads out there to share this one with their children. Our kids are anxious right now. My son is four, and he started biting his nails, and so I taught him this. And it's a mudra and a mantra, so it's placing your thumb to your pointer, your thumb to your middle finger, your thumb to your ring finger, and your thumb to your pinky finger, all while saying a mantra, which is a single-pointed focus, peace begins with me. Peace, Peace begins, begins with me. Say it, right? Peace, Peace begins I was saying it in my head. With, with me. me. Well, actually, you can say it in your head. I'm not going to be so hard on you. I'm saying Peace so many things in my head. with me. This is good. But actually, yeah, that's I think why. About this. So if you are it, saying it so many things in your head, that single-pointed right? focus gets you out of all the stories. We're going to have the best afternoon ever. You better. Thank you, Gabby Bernstein, for being here. Be sure to pick up a copy of her book, Happy Days, available everywhere books are sold. We'll be right back with the inbox here. On the